subscribe ecofan for more educational videos thank you welcome to our channel where we explore the wonders and challenges of our natural world today we are diving into the fascinating topic of glacial lake outburst flooding a powerful force of nature that can have significant consequences for both the environment and human populations so let's dive in glacial lake outburst flooding glof refers to the sudden release of water from a glacial lake typically caused by the failure of a natural or artificial dam that holds the lake in place glofs are a significant natural hazard in mountainous regions where glaciers are present When glaciers melt or experience an unusually high amount of melting, they can create glacial lakes. These lakes are often dammed by moraines, debris left behind by the glacier, or ice masses. However, if the water pressure exceeds the strength of the dam, it can lead to a catastrophic failure, resulting in a rapid release of water downstream. The occurrence of glacial lake outburst flooding (GLOF) is influenced by several factors that can increase the risk of these events. Let's explore some of the key contributing factors. climate change one of the primary drivers of glofs is climate change rising global temperatures have led to increased glacial melting worldwide as glaciers melt they contribute to the formation of glacial lakes the larger the glacial lake the greater the potential for a glof climate change accelerates the rate of glacial melt creating larger and more unstable lakes that are prone to outbursts glacier retreat Glacier retreat occurs when glaciers lose more ice through melting and calving than they gain through snow accumulation. As glaciers recede, they often leave behind depressions or basins that fill with water, forming glacial lakes. However, these lakes can be held in place by natural dams made of ice, rock debris, moraines, or even unstable ice masses. When the glacier retreats too far or the water pressure becomes too high, the dams can fail, triggering a GLOF. Seismic activity Earthquakes and other forms of seismic activity can also contribute to the occurrence of GLOFs. Strong ground shaking during an earthquake can destabilize or rupture the natural or artificial dams holding glacial lakes. The sudden release of water from the lake can cause a rapid and catastrophic flood downstream. Avalanches and landslides. The occurrence of avalanches or landslides in mountainous regions can have a significant impact on glacial lakes. When an avalanche or landslide occurs near a glacial lake, it can cause the dam to collapse or be overtopped, leading to a sudden release of water. The mass of debris and sediment carried by the flood waters can exacerbate the destructive power of the GLOF. Glacial lake growth and drainage patterns. The growth and drainage patterns of glacial lakes can influence the occurrence of GLOFs. Glacial lakes can expand rapidly as glacial meltwater accumulates. The expansion of the lake increases the pressure on the dam, raising the risk of failure. Conversely, sudden drainage of the lake, such as through a tunneling process beneath the ice dam, can also trigger a GLOF. Proximity to populated areas. The risk posed by GLOFs is amplified when glacial lakes are situated in close proximity to populated areas or infrastructure. Communities downstream from glacial lakes are particularly vulnerable to the devastating impacts of a sudden outburst. The high volume of water, debris, and sediment carried by a GLOF can result in severe damage to homes, roads, bridges, and other infrastructure, as well as pose a threat to human lives. It is important to note that these factors can interact and amplify each other. For example, climate change can lead to glacier retreat and the formation of larger glacial lakes, which increases the risk of dam failure. Similarly, seismic activity can trigger both glacier retreats and the collapse of natural or artificial dams. Understanding these factors and their interplay is crucial for assessing and managing the risks associated with glacial lake outburst flooding. Early warning systems, monitoring technologies, and mitigation strategies can help mitigate the potential impact of GLOFs on vulnerable communities and infrastructure. Thank you for watching the video.